I'd like to show you the latest development in card identification technology. We used to use peaks and marked cards. Those are all things of the past because now we can use what we call calculator cards. And I just so happen to have a little packet right here. These are all the rage and they are impeccably accurate. Let me show you how they work. They're very easy to use now. All you have to do is get them within close proximity to the card that you want to know the value of, and the calculator cards are going to start to mm, mm, generate numbers that are going to be reflective of the value of the card that we don't even know. Sounds confusing. I promise it's not. In fact, I think they're done. Let's see how good we got. Oh, perfect. Looks like we're ready to go. In fact, they generated numbers on the back that will tell us what this value is. Maybe you can help me add these up. We got a 1 plus 3 is 4. 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. Of course, they also generate them on the face as well. That's 4 plus 3 plus 1 plus 1 gives us 9. But don't take my word for it. Go ahead and push the equals button. They do. And when you push the equals button, it actually spells out the answer for you. And when I say spell out, I mean literally spell out. That's 9. N I N E. Of course, that means nothing unless I can't even look. You look. Oh, perfect. The nine of spades. That's exactly what we're looking for. But please, no, no, no. Please do not be impressed by that. That's a cheap parlor trick. These calculator cards are much better than that. They can do much more. In fact, let's look at this one. I'm not even going to look at this one. Just get it in your head. Just a little thought of this value. Don't show it to anybody else. In fact, if you could maybe multiply these two values, multiply this value by the 9. So you have a new total in your head. Nothing that I could possibly know. Nothing that anybody else in the room could possibly know. Go ahead and push the multiply button this time. So they do. And you say, no, 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 no. That's the equals button. Go ahead and push the multiply button. So they do. The first thing that happens when you push the multiply button on the calculator cards is the cards themselves multiply. Which is kind of cool in and of itself, but it means nothing. Unless it represents the total that you're just thinking of. Think of that total. Let's see how close we got. 3 plus 1 is 4. Plus 4 is uh, 8, I guess. 8 plus 5 would be 13, plus another 5 would be 18. So if this is a 2, I think that's pretty successful. Yes! Yes! But of course, now that I think about it, that's kind of a silly thing to do, because you push the equals button. And you know what happens when you push the equals button. It spells out the answer for you. And when I say spell, I mean literally. Spell. 18. Everything's examinable. The cards, the calculator cards. Hope you enjoy.